Hi, and welcome to 3450 News. I'm Marissa Pulaski. Top fitness experts have been expressing their anger over the new American reality TV show, Fat March, which they say has contestants doing an excessive amount of exercise, putting them at a high risk for injuries. The severely obese contestants must walk 575 miles in 10 weeks as part of the challenge. What the hell am I doing? During the first two weeks of the show, a 274-pound female contestant quit because she said her lower back and feet hurt. A young man was rushed to the emergency room for dehydration, and a 519-pound man was taken to hospital with blisters and possible stress fractures in his feet. Overweight pets are being sought to take part in a slimming initiative by a veterinary charity which says a quarter of UK dogs are now obese. The PDSA pet charity analyzed the weight of 4,000 dogs across the UK and found that the fattest were in the northeast of England, where 28% of dogs were overweight. Experts say obese pets are more likely to suffer premature death as well as develop diabetes and arthritis. The PDSA Pet Fit Club competition will be selecting eight animals to be put on a diet and fitness program with the most improved pet crowned PDSA Pet Fit Club champion. And finally, the World Diabetes Foundation is hosting a charity performance of Song and Verse at Cadogan Hall in London on the 14th of October. The aim of the event is to raise funds to support five projects in Cambodia, which the WDF runs in collaboration with the World Health Organization, Cambodian Diabetes Association, and the Ministry of Health in Cambodia. Proceedings from the performance will go towards integrating diabetes services and exploring creative ways for patients to manage their own diabetes. To find out more about the event and how you can purchase tickets, you can visit the Cadogan Hall website. That's it for this week, and remember, if you have a story you'd like to share, you can email us at info at 3450.com. Thanks for watching, and join us next week for 3450 News.